On this week's show, we take a look at the fierce Hill Week competition. We listen to the very talented performers in the Laurentians, and we share a moving excerpt from our Veterans Day commemoration. Lawrenceville's 10-minute newscast begins now. We have an exciting show in store, but first, the news headlines. Covering one final lap of the pool on floats, Hal Wilder was given a spirited send-off by the water polo team. Mr. Wilder, who is retiring from teaching and coaching next year, founded water polo at Lawrenceville as a club in the 1970s, and it became a varsity sport shortly thereafter. Since then, Mr. Wilder has coached both boys' and girls' varsity teams and led them both to championship wins. Girls' varsity athletics finished their blowout season. Field hockey, soccer, and tennis teams all won the Mabel Championships. In addition, field hockey took state prep in Mercer County, finishing the season 18-2, and tennis took state, finishing undefeated 10-0. In house football, Hamill warmly celebrated their win against Kennedy to win the crutch. Oh, this will make well 10. I'm going to be on the news. Can we smile? Smile. Yeah. Definitely smile, boys. Lawrenceville's Hutchkin Scholars gave presentations in the Kirby Science Center about their summer research at the same venue Fifth former shared their fall independent study. More than 800 gifts were pledged on Big Red Giving Day, resulting in over $800,000 being raised for the school. And finally, a story that began in the 1887, when representatives from Lawrenceville and, Hills, and the Hill School met on the football field and began what 127 years later is the fifth oldest high school rivalry in the country. From the annual bonfire that precedes the Hill weekend, here is Chisholm. Chisholm? Thanks, Gael. Things are definitely heating up here at the annual Hill Bonfire. The torch of competitive spirit has been lit, and hundreds of Laurentians have accumulated to show their spirit. The energy right now is excited and pumped up for the games tomorrow at the Hill School. Various teams and student groups are showing their school pride, including boys varsity soccer, the Wood Hull House, and the Tour de Force, a dance squad. And now to coverage directly from the homecoming weekend at the Hill School. That's it. The next morning, five busloads of fans went to Hill. This is Grant Keller and Grant Newsom, captains of the 2014 Big Red football team, reporting on the Big Red's win against our rival Hill School. On Saturday, November 8th, 16 Big Red athletic teams traveled to Pottstown, Pennsylvania to take on the Hill School. The marquee game featured the 127th playing of the Lawrenceville Hill football game. The Big Red came in with a 4-4 record, while the Hill School, despite many close outings, came in with an 0-7 record. Despite the disparity in the team's records, both sides knew that anything could happen in a rivalry game of this magnitude. The Big Red jumped to a 14-0 lead in the first quarter off the arm of PG quarterback Nick Duncan as he connected with receiver Isaiah Wingfield and tight end John Lager. The Hill School refused to go down without a fight and battled back to outscore the Big Red 13-7 in the second quarter heading into halftime with the Big Red leading by a small margin of 21 to 13. The third quarter was controlled by the defenses of both teams as the Hill School forced two turnovers to hold the Big Red to seven points in the quarter. The Big Red defense responded with a strong quarter as well, holding the Hill School offense to six points. Heading into the fourth quarter with a score of 28 to 19 in favor of the Big Red, the game was up for the taking. Behind touchdown runs from Nick Duncan and John Davis, as well as dominating performances from Luke Capuzzi and Hill alumnus and current Lawrenceville postgraduate, Grant Smith, the Big Red pulled away to secure a 49-26 win. This win marked the fifth consecutive Big Red victory over the Hill School, including an undefeated campaign for the 2015 seniors and a third straight win for the head coach Danny O'Day over the Hill School. Thanks to everyone who competed and supported our athletes this past weekend. This has been Grant Keller and Grant Newsom reporting for L10. Go Big Red! Thank you, Chisholm, and both Grant for that. Lawrenceville finished till week with 13 victories, three losses, and a tie. And now we have the Laurentians performing Paul Simon's April Come She Will, recorded at Midday Music on November 7th. <laughs>
We've seen tremendous spirit and dedication this week. So on Veterans Day, we took a moment to reflect and to remember that none of this would have been possible without the enormous sacrifices made in the defense of our country. In a time-honored tradition, students and faculty gathered at Flagpole Green to remember fallen Laurentians. It is our custom to read the honor roll, the names of Laurentians who have died in the service of our country. This reading takes four minutes or so. Your minds and your hearts may wander, but we hope not too far from the sacrifice they made for our freedom. The reading of the names. From the Civil War, James M. McIntosh. From the Spanish-American War, Gerard Merrick Ives. Francis Lieber. Dennis Mann Mitchie. Walter Bernard Van Zandt. From World War I, Campbell Elias Babcock. Samuel Dennison Babcock. Garrett Cochran. George Frederick Norton. James Knight Nichols. Frederick Campbell Colson. Philip Johnson Scudder. Alexander Pope Humphrey Jr. Talcott Hunt Clark. Carl Martin Williams. Howard Kilson Harris. Raymond Witten Thompson. James Jackson Porter. Robert Eugene Fishkoff. Ami Wright Lancashire. John Lyons Mayer. Robert Lincoln Campbell. William Clinton Story. Walton Kimball Smith. James G. Zimmerman. Philip James Davidson. James Alfred Holden. Cornelius John McCarthy. Edwin Thorpe Van Dusen. William Henry Crosius. Mortimer Park Crane. Arthur Brooks McCleave. Edgar Harold Loud. Jarvis Janess O'Futt. James Dana Paul. Cabell Brickenridge Ten Eck. Robert Ambrose Bowl. Newell Rodney Fisk. Perry Ross Rosenheim. Joseph Waterhouse. Frederick George Wilmson. Everett Townsend Young. Richard Ashley Blodgett. Joseph Stonson Craig. Gerald Provost Thomas. George William West Berryman. Donald Guild Bishop. Alexander Brown Bell. Joseph Benson Graham. George Elmer Blakesley. John Martyr Perry. Barton Wilkinson Elliott. Alfred Moore Scales Jr. From World War II, Ferris Fleming Hamilton. Joseph Weldon Bailey. Hanford Nicholas Lockwood Jr. George Dewey Simon. Preston Samuel Moore. Philip Joyce. Theodore Freelingheisen. Her Henry Escher the Jr. Richard Atkinson's Claybook. Arthur Duane Jones. Lewis William Rothstenstein. Robert Lee Nevitt. Eugene Cowles Pomeroy Jr. Josiah Morris Baldwin Jr. Rogers Kirk Young. Edward Bosner Cochran. Sam Reynolds Marks Jr. Philip Elliott Stewart. Kemble White Jr. John Philip Bartlett. Daniel Bernard Blesser. Da David Miles Lustig. James Abog McMillan. Robert Meeker Reed. Montauk Born Waterhouse. Henry Bunn. Robert Skurzum McDonald. Gilbert Vivian Michaels. Robert Lucian Shedden. Jacques Rodney Eisner. Percy Meredith Hall, Jr. Walter Dornick Idema, Jr. Robert Martin Proctor. William Gunn Shepherd, Jr. Howard Anthony Smith, Jr. Arthur Peter Adams. Thomas Kelly Brown. Rudd Robertson Brill. Maurice Kirby Colgate. Harry Lewin Evans, Jr. Donald Glendare Griffin. Douglas Den Denison Shackleton. Ernest Robertson Ackerman. Mark Hall. Charles Alfred Higgins, Jr. Barry Knight. John Joseph Landsberg. Edward Edgar Lowry, Jr. William Graves Robertson. Donald Nichols Sharp. John Highland Sinnott. George, George Parker Toms, Jr. Derek Tilton Vale III. John Francis Burke. Douglas Metcalf Colginson. John Andrew Eckbert III. Carl Stewart Lawton, Jr. William Howard Stovall, Jr. Robert James Wilson. William Frederick Allworth. Tobias Alf Arthur Carno, Jr. William H. Culpepper Lee. William Purcell Abbott. Donald Edward Fuller. David Mixell. Frederick Robert Towater. Uh, from the Korean War, Captain William M. Murphy. Eugene J. Murphy. George Stevens Brainard. Carl P. Schmidt. Courtney C. Davis, Jr. 
Robert W. Allen. John C. F. Walker. Warren Webster III. David A. Qua Crawford, Jr. Henry Walling, Jr. PFC James N. Ramsey, Jr. Garrett L. Schoonmaker <coughs> from Vietnam. Hugh C. Lobit. David J. Decker. Richard Warren Pershing. Brett L. Hollander. Sean Flynn. From the Iraq War, Jordan A. Bedio. We will now hear taps. And with that, we would like to end our show for Sunday, November 16th. I'm Guy L. Phobes, and from all of us here at L10, good luck with your finals, and thank you so much for watching.